knowledge that I proclaim, if you don't fuck with me because of it, you just don't fuck with me. Truth be told is there's, even though I have to grow and let go of chief, I ain't gotta let go of the knowledge just to make you feel better. So you can be convinced that I've moved on with my journey. If me being out here in Honduras by myself in my own apartment, paying my own bill, bills, feeding my own damn self, is not enough convincing for you that, that I'm doing this on my own, that's just fine with me. Your perception is not my reality. If you don't want to support me, that's fine. I'm out here by myself. You want to support that or not. But you're not going to tell me what to say, how to say, when to say it, who to say it to, whatever. I'm going to get these lessons. I am the elite. I am the pure in heart. I have to get these lessons from every lesson, from every level. And one thing, I see my guilt in this whole situation now that I've really evaluated it. Like, she keeps saying, I don't listen, which I don't listen. He told me when I... Start calling the girls, start talking to the girls. I can call him, he, that all of them are there for me and I need to reach out to them more. Did I listen? No. So when my emotions are high and he don't seem to give a fuck, whose fault is that? I didn't create the bond and the relationship that he opened himself and the family up for me to create. That's fine. I'm just gonna do me for a while and maybe forever. But anything new that comes up with carbonation, I'm not gonna know about it. Cause I'm about to really, really go like into my own little world. Every, every, I'm so glad you did the mixtape because I love that mixtape. That mixtape, I feel like I've been crazy the past three weeks since I, since I haven't had my phone and I can't connect my Bluetooth to this, to this device. So it's like, fuck, I think I've been crazy ever since I have been listening to the music and the mixtape all the time. And I'm not going to blame him for anything. Everything that's happening to me is my fault and I'm going to take accountability and I'm going to be strong and I'm going to move forward. Not with anybody's thoughts in my head but my own. When it comes to the knowledge, the stuff that I resonate with and that you still will hear me say, that's because that's my own thoughts. See, there's no new thoughts. There are, there are only thought frequencies. So if you don't like the frequency of me saying the things that I say, you can unsubscribe. So if you rock with me, rock with me because I got my own place in the tropics. I'm paying my own bills. I'm feeding my own self. I ain't getting dicked by nobody. Ain't nobody helping me. I ain't doing nothing but just trying to show you nature and learn myself at the same time. First, learn myself while showing you nature because you're not my priority. I am my priority. I'm here to teach you how to learn how to dive through my own experience by going through my own generational curses and learning myself. to listen. I do. I do. Not to listen to be just to be a follower like a yes man because I can never be that and I will never listen to anyone that will position me to be just a yes man. Like I'm totally unhappy in my heart and I'm just doing this. Like I could follow someone to a certain extent but then what ends up happening is, is I, I get to a point where I have to express myself and that's where I end up disconnecting from carbonation over and over. Floating back on and floating off and floating back on, but this time is different. This time I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna just live. I want y'all to see me play. I play a lot. I want, to, I want y'all to see me laugh. I laugh a lot. I want y'all to feel the energy of mother. I care a lot, and I'm gonna focus on that. Chief is right. You don't, you don't, you don't tell all your business. Your, you don't tell your family business to the public. You tell troll business to the public. And I'm going to stop doing that. And no, I'm not going to reach out to him. And no, I'm not going to talk to him. I'm just going to take the notes that I have and just keep it pushing. I can't watch his new videos because I don't know what to expect. It's too unpredictable for me. But if I watch the past three years of videos, I think I'm good. I think I'm really good because it's all the things that I resonate with. So with that being said, it's time for me to show y'all my strength and my power with that. It's time for me to elevate and show y'all the woman that I am. I'm mother. How y'all doing? It's just time for me to focus on that. I love myself. And y'all have a beautiful, beautiful evening. running water right now i think there's well not i think i know there's a rock blocking the water that's what happens here 
because it comes straight from the stream. I'm walking down the mountain. I'm a, I'm, I'm like, I'm not obviously all the way up the mountain, but I'm up the mountain. I'm walking down the mountain. Um, but I live on on the side of the mountain, and the water comes from up here. It goes through a filtration system. Um, it's a basic filtration system. It's not. I've seen it. It's literally like a little box thingy. And it's filtering the water for the whole village. Sometimes you the water will have a little brown tip to it because the rocks are moving a lot and I guess it can't filter it or something. I don't know how that works. So sometimes the water is, is like a little tint of brown. I'm from Mount Bayou, Mississippi. We had tinted brown water up until like I think like six years ago or five years ago. They finally changed out the system because the people ran tests on the water and the water was alkaline so they were like why should we make the water completely clear let's just leave it like that so the people wanted the water to stay like that up until i guess younger generations started coming through or whatever and they just want their water to look like everybody else's water so they finally changed the filtration system so i'm used to water like that i don't have a problem with it i do drink the water from the tap um, a lot of people you'll see they have bottled water. I do drink bottled water as well. Um, when I'm on the go, obviously, I grab some bottled water. And if I have it, I'm going to finish it. Um, but for the most part, I just drink water out of the tap. So I can be alkalated. You eat from the land, you drink from the land. And that's how you become alkalated to the land. So, yeah. I went to the Spring Creek to drink some water because there's no running water coming out of my tap right now. And it's like that water brought life back into me. Um, I was on the phone with someone. If you're in my live, just know my battery went dead. I had to come back and charge my phone. I'm trying to look, I'm looking at everything from a healthy perspective. I think I've talked to 10 people because I'm so considerate. I don't want anybody to feel like I'm ignoring them, but y'all have to understand. When I talk to y'all, that's energy. So my energy was low, and then I have a lot of people that want to show me their care and concern. And when your energy is already low, everything is energy exchange. Everything is sacred energy exchange. Everything is sex. So I'm, I'm having a lot of sex today. It's too much. I'm tired. <laughs> Can I breathe? <laughs> yeah. Hola. Hola. Come on, let's start. I'm trying to get a man out of my mind. You should help me. <laughs> nah, I see him all the time. I'm just playing with y'all. I see a lot of these men all the time. I'm just, my mind is where my mind is at. And uh, it is what it is. This man has every vehicle possible. Today is a bike, huh? I know, man. Switching it up? They haven't my Oh, it's broken? Ah, get your exercise. You need it. <laughs> it's for real, for real. Your waist is like a 45. Yeah. Anyway, so. Yeah, so what I'm going to do moving forward, I'm just going to specifically tell y'all because everybody has their own astrological programming. So it's not that easy for someone with a completely different astrological programming than I to completely understand how I am going to deal with this moving forward. So, let me tell you. I'm not going to watch any new carbonation anything. Please don't send me the lives. I don't want to watch them. Y'all love sending me lives. I don't want to watch them. If you watch an old carbonation video and it, re it resonates with you and you want to share with me because it has a message that you feel is profound, send that to me. When you feel the urge to send me things that don't serve my higher purpose, stop yourself because you're being a demon. You might not even realize you're being a demon. Stop yourself. You are being a demon. I repeat, I do not want to see anything new from Carbonation TV, from Carbonation's lives. I'm good. I don't want to know the new menu plan. I'm good. I don't want to know any of that. As far as I'm concerned, RIP Chief, for May You Rise in Power. That's where I'm at. There is no new information. There's no inf new information for you to give and share with me. Stop trying to hurt my subconscious. Be a good person. 
focus on yourself. If you are, do what y'all been doing. Y'all trolls, do troll stuff, but don't bring me into it. Come to the point where you be like, okay, I don't want to deal with that. Look at this. I think I'm walking up. Okay. No, I'm not. See, my energy was starting to raise up. Another whole situation. Like, I got to swerve. How am I going to swerve in this situation? I can't swerve from here. Man, say. <laughs> but no, it's cool. It's cool. It's cool. So, moving forward, y'all. Peace, peace. I went up there a day, but uh, you was not there. So, I came back down here. Did you find anything? No, I went up there to smoke weed with you. Oh. I'm about to go to the playa. I'll see you later. You want bread? No. I got enough bread right here already. I wish. He keeps trying to tell me I got a booty because he likes me. I ain't got no booty. You ain't got to lie to me. <laughs> anyway. Um, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. Moving forward, you guys. I don't want to see anything new from Carbonation. I got enough old lessons, enough old videos to help me with my journey that I don't even have to be current on carbonation. I'm good. I'm good. And if you really care about the black woman, if you really care, don't send me no more lives about anything moving forward because it does not serve my higher self. And I'm trying to detox off of this man. I'm trying to get my mind together. Yeah, he still say some true stuff. Even in, when he made me cry today, he said, I don't listen, which is true. And that I was, I'm wrong to tell family business to everybody. That's wrong. I wouldn't do that to, to my relatives. That's wrong. And no matter how all y'all see it, trolls, um, biased news, re news reporters, me, carbonation, we are a family, a dysfunctional ass family. You cannot watch uh, somebody every single day and then claim y'all not family. You cannot know somebody's personality based off of their character and the things that they consistently do and say that y'all are not family. It's a frequency. There are billions of people in the world. There's only a few of us that have gravitated to this particular frequency, which means we are a soul family, a dysfunctional ass soul family. Remind you of anything? Remind you of you and your relatives a little bit? Just a little bit. Just a little bit. You know them relatives you, you can't stand and they talk shit every time you get together or they always doing shit to hurt you and shit and then you be trying to work it out because that's your family. You be trying to work it out and shit don't be working out. They be going in all type of directions. They be doing all type of things. And you just be like, what the fuck is this shit? But you still keep going. And that's the same thing here. I can't deal. I can't deal with the fact that I can't listen. I can't listen to you. He said, I have a problem listening. I agree. I have a problem listening. He always said that to me. All the time. You don't listen. You don't listen. That shit be ringing in my ear. Listen. Fuck you, man. I don't agree. So how can I listen? And you haven't presented anything objective for me to be like, oh, okay, now he's presenting objectivity with the B12, B6. But I can't see it like... Where do the animals get the B12 from? Where do the animals get the B6 from? Mm -hmm. Where they get it? We eating the animals that's eating plants and he's the one who taught me that. This shit is crazy, that's why. Everything from the time he said we're eating meat and beyond, I'm not interested anymore. I'm gonna pretend like the whole everything just stopped. At whatever last video or live I choose to. And he just died. All right, PT. May you rise in power. Because you know we rise again when we reincarnate. So may he reincarnate in power. May he come back more in tune with himself and whatever it is that he needs to do. I don't know his life path number. So yeah. I'm fucked up with everybody. Y'all don't fuck with me like that. But y'all fuck with me a little bit. Y'all don't fuck with me like that because I still say you're. I still say I love myself. Peace to God. I'm thankful. Hello, sweetie. I'm thankful and all of these other things. Because this is me. This is all me. You can't you can't resonate with something that's not you. It's certain people back in the 90s that used to listen to Easy E. And it's certain people in the 90s that used to listen to Whitney Houston. Like 
you just hate Easy E because he got AIDS and he died, but you still like his music? Like, shit, what the fuck? Like, what the fuck? That music hella gets my spirits up for whatever reason. That's just an example that came to my head. There's many examples you can pull for yourself. What is my point? I learned my lesson, man. I learned my lesson, and I'm going to teach other women. I have always been the type of woman to be, um, I always get, like, boss type of niggas, like, leader type of niggas. Like, I've always been with a leadership type of man. Like, that's just me. I think they balance out my energy, and Chief is the first person that I found that completely balances out my energies. Like, I think it's Taurus. I think I want a Taurus man. I think I do. Like, let me at least try it. Because I've never been with a Taurus man. And I met two Taurus men. And both of them pissed me off. Chief is one. Another one is another one. On this journey. Like, I got to be specific. And I, I, something about their energy draws in my soul kind of thing. So I think I want to... Let me, let me date a Taurus. And see how I feel. Because I feel that energy is very, very strong. For me. What the fuck is, am I looking at right now? Like my eyesight. Oh, okay. Huh. <laughs> I don't know. What the hell? I don't know. I don't know. I guess it's culture. I don't know. So anyway, it looks like the devil to me. And to me, that was the universe telling me to face my demons. <laughs> so I'm going to face my demons. And I'm not going to blame Chief. I'm not going to do that no more. Y'all ain't even finna hear me talking about them no more. Like, today is the last day. Inshallah. <laughs> that I'm going to sit down and talk about these people, what, how they hurt me, how they're not recognizing my pure heart, how I've been struggling to try to get them to just see me, when the truth is is that she presented an opportunity for me to get to know the whole family better after I denounced Goku. He was like, don't deal with no people, just call me, call the women here, talk to us, stay on your own, do your thing. Did I listen? No. And that's the problem he said he always had with me. I don't listen. And I'm going to continue to not listen because I got to get my lessons my way. I would love for him to be like, she don't listen, but I still love her because I know she's loyal and I'm going to help her through her shit and we're going to all grow. But that's not the case. It is what it is. In order for me to grow, I have to fall off of carbonation's frequency. And that's what I realized. I must fall off of carbonation's frequency in order to grow into the person that I'm meant to be. Well, why not? Your dress is really pretty. You see? It's like a flowy dress. It's pretty. Anyway, so... That's what I got to do. I got to put all of that energy back into myself. Take all of y'all advice. Throw it out the window. And listen to intuitive self. Because intuitive self got all the answers. The question is, is, am I listening? And if I'm not listening, whose fault is it but my own? I don't want y'all to keep looking at me like I'm weak because y'all see me crying. I'm just a cancer sign. I'm a cancer rising, cancer sun, cancer Mercury and Mars. And it's debilitated in Mars. Is it debilitated in Mars or Mercury? I think it's Mars. Yeah, so I got to deal with my emotions. This is who I am. Y'all are just seeing who I am. I cry in my real life. Like, I really do. I don't cry all the time because I, I don't have a reason to cry all the time. I don't have situationships that will make me just cry all the time. We're nice. So... But when y'all do see me crying, it's like, oh, my goodness, you know, oh, my goodness. Like, I got stressed like normal people. It's just my reaction is to cry when I'm stressed. Some people's reaction is to kill motherfuckers. And then there's all those things in the toilet. You know? But I'm growing. Damn, I forgot to make a stop before I came all the way down here. I was distracted. But I just needed y'all to know I'm not weak. I'm not weak. I'm far from weak. It's just when people don't fully communicate with me, like, I just feel like me and Chief are missing, like, a big-ass conversation. But, hey, that's my fault because he told me to be calling them and getting to know everybody more, and I did not listen. So when shit got real and he switched up everything in carbonation, and then I came at it the way I did, it was just like, fuck her, man. She ain't even calling us and talking to us or nothing. People ask me, do they support me in my life? Actually, they were coming into my life and um, giving me support when I needed it. Um, 
I didn't do my part to get closer to him. And it is what it is because I didn't do my part. Is that my friend? No. And I'm going to deal with that. Okay, it's getting really loud this way. Okay, so before I go that way, let me just say what I need to say in this live. I'm not going to blame Chief. Even though he hurt me, but I positioned myself to be hurt because I didn't listen. I didn't follow the way of carbonation, and I would have never followed the way of carbonation. Because I always got a disagreement and opinion. I have my own mind. But he was right when he says the way I go about expressing myself is wrong. I can fully express myself, but I should not come on a live to do it if I see these people as my family. But when I reach out to them individually, like the women, and they don't respond, like Faith didn't respond, um, I'd be like, y'all fake as fuck. Y'all ain't real family members. And I should be happy that the universe exposed these people that are not genuine. Like, I'm, I hella got love for you. Why are you like this? Because the person is not genuine. Why am I expecting genuinity from people that are not genuine people? That's my fault. I got to deal with that. That's my weakness. That's my demon I must face. We can't play the blame game because when you point the finger, you miss the point. And although I was very hurt and appalled by what he did, I know that Chief must have seen something in me, but I didn't bring it to fruition because I have my own mind. But he did see something in me because I'm totally different than all the other women that he talks to. Totally different. I ain't set up like that. So moving forward I, again I don't want to I don't want y'all to send me no live I don't want to hear nothing nothing new y'all are going to eventually forget about me because I'm not the beautiful one and I'm not the one that's going to keep feeding the negativity so when you take those two things away most of y'all are going to fade and I'm okay with that and I accept that I'm going to pretend like carbonation ended at the last video I choose and I don't know what happened to them. They just faded. R.I.P. the Chief. May he rise in power. And that's the direction I'm growing. I'm out here in the jungle. By myself, man. Making friends. I ain't even really making friends. I tried to make a couple friends. They have stole money from me trying to make friends. It's like, damn. The... <sighs> trying to be the change I want to see. Got to learn these lessons along the way. Feeling for people and stuff like that in a impoverished country. Oh, my goodness. Like, I've had a lot of lessons taught to me here, too that y'all don't even know about. The guy that I cut off, that she told me to cut off, that nigga started going around this whole town telling everybody, making me look like I'm a thirst bot, because he is hella cute, he is really cute. And um, because I was ignoring him and I blocked him and I did all this, he started being extra. So now all these females are looking at me like, oh, this American girl, she's thirsty for this dude and shit, because I can't talk to them, and I don't want to anyway. I don't give a fuck, like I really don't, but it's childish, and I, I was in my lower self. And now, it's like, I got to deal with that energy, but I'm dealing with that just fine. I'm going to tell y'all about it one day, because I'm a strong woman. I'm a very strong woman, but Chief was able to get to me. Not every person can get to me like that. You can't get to me like that. Let's just be real. You can't make me cry. You can't do anything to me. Chief can because he has knowledge that I don't have yet, and I'm very, very attracted to his anointing. So he can hurt me, but most of y'all, y'all can't even penetrate a layer of me. That's why I don't even read y'all comments, because I protect my subconscious. Because I believe that if you really have something that you're trying to get across to me, you'll hit me up in my DM. You won't you won't just be in my lives. Cause I, the live is for the cloud chasers, trolls, um, for the most part. And then for those that genuinely love me, they'll put up hearts, green hearts. I like green hearts only. I'm actually the one that started the green heart thing. Because way back, maybe like two years ago, two and a half years ago, I started putting green hearts all the time in the chat. And then he started saying, everybody put up your green hearts. I love green hearts. I love that color. It's just beautiful to me. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and um, go to the playa. I just came from the, well, I just come from the river. I went to the river. I drank some alkaline water. My cells feel good. I feel better. I'm accepting what I did in the situation. I'm accepting my faults in the situation, which is talking about my soul family online. I apologize. I should have went directly to Chief and Chiefess when Chief when Chiefess got back there. I should have just been like, what's good with you, whatever, whatever. If that's the direction I wanted to grow. But that's not the direction I want to grow. I want to do this by myself, but not by myself. I want people to resonate with my frequency and gravitate to this frequency that I am on. 
I no longer want to try to do anything. Anything that is meant to be will flow naturally and it will not hurt. That's the lesson that I got out of it. So come along with me on this journey if you like to. I'm in the middle of the town. Come along with me if you like to. And see the interesting size of a third world country. Man, I be tripping out. It's so much stuff I don't tell y'all because I'm still learning. It's a third world country. <laughs> it's a lot of things that people that are here don't know about because they come here to these lands and they don't engage the people. They don't have anything to offer the people. They come here and they just take. They take the fruit. They take the land and they don't have anything to offer the people. They don't try to get to know the people culturally. I'm trying to get to know the people culturally to get to understand them so I can relate to some people on some level um, in, in times where I have to interact with them. I don't like looking like a complete retard in situations because I'm completely, um, like, just culturally, I don't know shit. So I can't even interact at all. I don't want to be that kind of a person. Everybody always looking at me, y'all. I swear I'm like a mini celebrity in this mug. Me and Goku is just like, <laughs> oh my goodness. But anyway, we always walking with our camera. It's weird. It's weird here. So, yeah. Anyway, I learned my lesson. What's up, girl? <laughs> I learned my lesson moving forward. I'm not blaming anybody. I'm just apologizing for talking about people online because they was wrong and everything I said was true, but I should have just went to them and said it and used this platform. If I want to talk about somebody, I should talk about the trolls. I should talk about the people that wish evil for me. And some people may say he wishes evil for me by the way he's treating me. That's all perception. I could just take what I want and leave the rest and be good. And that's what I'm going to do moving forward. That was the lesson of the day for me. He told me um, I also need to learn how to let go. Chief actually told me that. I need to learn to let go. So maybe that's the lesson I need to learn in this situation. I'm not as weak as y'all may think. Just because y'all see me cry, that's just... People break communication with me and I don't know what the fuck. I just cry. Because it's like, I really want to have a whole conversation. Why won't you let me talk to you? Why would you block me when you could talk to me? But then... Maybe people don't like the way I respond. Respond, react. Everything is about response, reaction, response, reaction. So, somebody don't like the way I fucking respond, and they respond the way they respond, and I don't like the way they respond. It is what it is, and it's not what it's not. Moving forward. Let me show y'all some beautiful shit. Let me show y'all how to, how to make some beautiful recipes for eating organically from the earth. Let me show y'all how we are waking up and then these people living in a natural environment are going to sleep. Peace, peace. Let me show you how to elevate yourself based off of where I'm at. Because I can only teach you what I know. I cannot teach you what I don't know. So what can I not teach you right now? How to let go. I can't teach you that yet. Because I'm in the process of learning how to let go. But I can definitely teach you how to eat organically from the earth. I can teach you about grounding. I can teach you about melanin. I can teach you about cells. I can teach you about astrology to a certain extent. So I'm going to focus on those things and make those things that are strong even stronger and make my weaknesses strengths. I'm going to become a very powerful person. Like, y'all see me right now in my journey? And y'all like, man, her journey looks like... Uh, whatever your perception is. And then, later on, y'all gonna be like, wow, this girl was not playing no games. Like, she was really here to get these lessons so she could elevate. I'm not here to fake for nobody. So when you see me crying, and you see me vulnerable, and you see all these moments like that, just know that I'm not staying there. This is a part of my elevation. There are women like me. Women like me who don't really know how, ooh, there go my little husband. He's so cute. Ooh. Um, yeah, I love that little boy. Anyway, so I'm learning. You may not get it, but you'll get it in time. And I'll be able to help someone else. And in the midst of all of y'all that be coming to me, it's always somebody that comes to me that has a similar story, that can relate, that's going through something or went through something. Every lesson is for someone. First me, and then whoever else it resonates with. Keep that in mind. 
with me being uh, Leo Moon in the first house, I ain't the type of chick to sweat no nickel. I ain't the type of chick. Oh, you think I'm ugly? Okay, cool. You think I'm cute? Okay, cool. Either way, I'm going to do what I want to do. I want you. Like, I could be like, I've always been the type of female, like, I'll go somewhere and I'll, I'll spot a guy. I'm like, ooh, you like the alpha dude here. And I'll be like, I want you. And I always get that person. <laughs> confidence. Men love confidence more than any other thing. So, be that. Y'all be thinking I'm insecure and all type of stuff. No, like, it's just, I ain't never met nobody like Chief. Like, mm, I ain't met nobody like him, and I, don't wanna, I did not want to lose him. It's like hella people on the playa today. I don't even know if I want to be over here. Like, it's too many energies. I don't know what I'm going to do with all these energies. I'm not with it. I'm going to go. Yeah, there's a lot of energy here. I'm trying to feel the vibe. Family vibe, though. It's a family vibe. I can feel it. Um, mosquitoes a little bit. And whatnot. Everybody looking at me because my outfit, like, sexy and shit. Like, everybody looking at me. Who would be calling me while I'm on live? Who does that? Anyway... With that being said, moving forward. What's up? PJ? Good. You good? I think I'm good. You're always checking up on me. <laughs> He's an amazing photographer. That me and him, when I come back, I wish I didn't have to leave so bad. Like universe, just put one thousand dollars in my account right now. Ping! I could stay. Me and him are gonna put together like the bomb ass photo shoot like it's gonna be on some some shit like you ain't even seen this yet i'm telling y'all i'm so powerful i need to start calling myself chief this facts like i'm about to come out with some type of shit like and it's gonna be real it's not just gonna be for the camera like we really doing this in real life you gonna see you gonna see man i got an ideal in my head that is so grand I have an ideal in my head how like like locals here are gonna start becoming vegan. They're gonna start eating holistic again because they used to eat holistic. Even though they ate fish, it was still holistic, you know what I'm saying? No processed foods. But you're gonna see, you're gonna see what the universe is going to use me for and it's gonna flow naturally and it's gonna be beautiful. The way I met King J was so natural. It's so crazy because my intuition was like, walk up to that guy. And um, ask him, do he knows anybody that takes pictures? And I was like, for what? I'm literally having a conversation with myself. And I was like, for what? Like, but I was like, you know what? I'm going to just listen. And I walked up to him. And he was like, I'm a photographer. And I was like, nigga, you lying. And he was like, yeah, I'm a photographer. And he showed, opened up his Instagram. And he showed me all his pictures. He's on my, I'm following him. I'm only following eight people. And he's one of them. And, um... Is that like a... Anyway, I'm nosy. So, <clears throat> so yeah, so me and him, he, we're going to do some amazing work. Like, I'm inspired. I'm inspired. Yeah, I'm definitely inspired. But it's going to be my own thing. I don't know if I'm walking the wrong way. What part of the village is this? I don't know where I'm at. Okay, I might be the wrong way. I need to turn around because I don't want to make the wrong turn and be in a bushy area that I'm not familiar with. Fuck that. So, let me do the long walk. I'm about to get off this live. I just need to let you know that I'm not weak. I just get sad. I have moments of frustration. That's my astrological programming. I, but then I always calm down. Wait for it. That's what I'll tell you with me. Wait for it. Because I always desire to keep my heart as light as a feather. And the only way I can keep my heart as light as a feather is by facing my demons facing myself this shit don't stop this is really not a stop watch it don't never stop facts so support me because you support me support me because i'm out here by myself if you would rather i don't care just plain and simple i don't care if you with me you with me if you're not you're not i got a beautiful spirit i got a beautiful energy i'm mother like if you don't want to get to know me i accept that I'm letting go. No more of thinking, how do I show these people my heart? How do I put my heart on display? No more. No more. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. No more. Moving forward, 
No more. Buenas. Ariana. No more. It's, Chief told me this a while ago. He was like, about three months, he was like, you want to save people? Why do you want to save people? Hey, mama. Hey. Hi. What you doing? Hiya. You having fun? I swear she, she stops smiling every time she see herself. She'll be like, heck of smiling. As soon as the camera come on, she'll just stop smiling. It's you, mama. Hello, how are you? <laughs> I'll see you later, mama. Hmm? I'll see you later, mama. Huh? I cannot just stand here all day like this. I was on this thing and I forgot what I was supposed to buy just to come over here. Oh, there's your smile. Yeah, mama. Yeah, mama. You're so beautiful. I see you. I cannot stay. I'll come back. Right. I'm coming back. I'm coming back. I'll see you later, okay? Oh, you blowing kisses? You blowing those some kisses? <laughs> oh, can I go now? I'll see you later, okay? I'll see you later. You're going to scream. I already know. Ariana. I'll see you later, mama. I really got to go all the way, kind of like halfway back. I'm coming back, mama. I'm coming back. I don't know where your mama at, but... Hmm. Ariana! See you later, mama. So, yeah. Tomorrow is a new day, and it's a new chance for me to get it right. Because today, I did not get it right. Tomorrow, I will get it right. And I noticed that y'all feed on drama, which means I'm going to lose... 85% of the people following me once there's no more drama. And I'm okay with that because if the 15% riding with me, riding with me, let's get it. Let's get it. We out here. We in the jungle, man. Well, this part isn't the jungle. But where I was at is in the jungle. My part is the jungle. We out here in the tropics, man. By ourselves. As a woman. I've been stole from by two different men. Two different men. One of them was a taxi driver. He, he goes around here all the time. I can't do nothing about it. I just learned my lesson. Always have exact change. Because if you're a female out here in a third world country, ain't nobody going to go and get your money from that nigga. It just is what it is. So that was my lesson to learn. Always have exact change. The other lesson I'm learning is the dude that I was having sacred energy exchange with. Physical, you know what I'm saying? When I cut him off, he flipped out, man. He just flipped out. And I gotta deal with that. I gotta deal with all that. All the pieces of me. I got too much going on in my real life to be sitting up sad. I got real life lessons that is coming towards me all the time. So tomorrow is a new day to get it right. Tomorrow is a new day to start over. And that's what the fuck I'm gonna do. Live my best life and I'm not about to worry about who believes me anymore. Because I know myself and people that interact with me, they know that I'm the realest. Ain't no faking this in my blood. Where they had that at? I'm from Mississippi. Yeah, yeah, I'm in the 90 percenters, man. I'm almost 100 percent pure. Ain't no fake in my blood, man. I don't rock like that. And if you believe me, you believe me. If you don't, you don't. If you have the opportunity to be blessed with my presence, lucky you. Facts. If you have the opportunity to be my friend, lucky, 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 super lucky you. That's straight facts. I want to get to the point where I can say that about you. I don't... I, yeah, so moving forward, it's all about me. It's all about me. I'm going to start expressing my, my emotions from where they come from. Because what happens is, is that all that cancer energy, it builds up inside of me. And then that Leo moon, which is a masculine energy, first house, which is Aries, selfish, self-centered, all of that comes together and it comes out wrong. It does. It comes out wrong. It's like, damn, what happened? I should go from soft and feminine to that. That's my astrological programming. So, but I'm gonna, I'm going to come from a different space. Why not? I'm gonna come from a different space moving forward. That way, y'all don't be so confused <laughs> about my energies, cause I ain't weak. I ain't, I'm far from weak. My my grandmother's name is Aura. Aura. You don't even hear names like that no more. Aura. Ha. Huh. 
I ain't come from no weak womb. My grandmother, I grew up in an environment that looked like this without the mountains and the tropical trees. And except for the houses being made out of stone like this, the slave houses were made out of wood. How many of y'all have entered a slave house that wasn't a museum? Like, literally in your neighborhood. That's how I portaled in. I portaled into a grandmother bending over five, six hours. Five, six hours just to be able to um, garden and bring food to the family. I grew up where, where four, five, six women sat down all day shelling peas. That's how I grew up. That's how I was able to manifest this particular location of all black town, because that's how I grew up. And that's what I'm comfortable with. Well, I'm being taken outside of my comfort zone. Obviously, I'm starting to embrace other hues of the human race more, obviously, because we got these generational curses where light is right and black is like evil or something. Like, I don't know what the fuck. I'm dealing with that shit on multiple levels. So I'm facing my demons and I'm moving forward with my life. Last time I went that way, I don't think it went good for me. So that's what I'm doing. Fucking mosquitoes, man. They trying to eat me alive out here. I'm trying to tell you. Anyway, that's it. That's, I think that's it. Hola. Um, I'm rude. I'm just rude. I don't know. Um, that's it. I think that's it. I think I emptied my mind. I think I emptied my mind. I'm finna live from my intuition. I'm finna live from me. Not to make y'all believe me. Not to get chief to be like, oh, hell yeah. You know what I'm saying? She's legit. None of that no more. I ain't gonna live for none of y'all no more. I'm gonna go get me some lotion and a hair comb. Y'all got me misunderstood. Oh, my gosh. Somebody took this dog's eye out? What the hell? What kind of animal cruelty shit is that? That's the second dog I've seen with a missing eye, and that wound looks fresh. There's a demon walking around here harming these animals. I saw another animal with his foot cut. It was just hanging. And the person I was with, like, he's been like that for a year. There's a demon going around here harming these animals. Shit's crazy, it's wild, man. Shit's hella crazy, hella wild. For real. Okay. I'll talk to you guys later. I think I said everything that was in my heart. And yeah. I know some people are gonna unsubscribe. I know some people are not gonna wanna talk to me anymore. And I am good. I am good. I am totally good. I'm going to be 100% authentic to myself. And then those that are meant to be with me, they will be with me. I am not going to ever again talk about my soul family to y'all. Hola. Hola. Because at the end of the day, even us at our worst is better than a lot of y'all. For real, for real. Like, it's better than a lot of y'all. And whether y'all see it like that or not, that doesn't matter. What am I focusing my energy on? What is serving me by impressing y'all? I don't care if y'all donate or not. Even in this situation, I am not going to kiss anyone's ass for a donation. I ain't never been a type. My grandmother raised me to have this type of mindset. And my astrological programming goes along with that mindset. Like, I'm just not the type. If I never get another donation again, I'll still be good. I got, what, five days to get out of this country, and I got, like, what, $40 to my name? That's not enough money to get out of this country. But I still don't care. That's why I'm speaking right now. Instead of just being quiet, waiting until somebody donate, and then start talking my shit again, nah. I'm going to talk my shit before the donations. That way I know the person that donates to me is donated to my authentic self. I don't want money. I don't want to receive money from y'all when y'all receiving something from me that's not genuine to me. Fuck all of that. Fuck all of that. Y'all ain't finna put me into from one bondage of I put myself in with Chief 
to another bondage or put myself in with y'all. Nah, I'm good. I'm good. I'm just gonna do my journey by myself, my way. I'm gonna still say, yep, even though I ain't talking to Chief. I'm gonna still say I love myself, even though I ain't talking to Chief. I'm still gonna say I'm thankful, even though I ain't talking to Chief. You don't like it? You can either just rock with me or not. There's no middle. You rocking or not? You rocking or not? But y'all ain't gonna drain me no more. Y'all are not gonna drain me. I have so much beauty to show people that I haven't been focusing on showing them all the beauty because I've been focusing on other shit. And then I have moments. I'm good, I'm good, I'm hella good. But I could be focusing all of my energy on what I truly want. Like, I got this beautiful image in my head of what I truly want. <laughs> okay. I got this beautiful image in my head of what I truly want. And it hasn't manifested yet. So what, do else, what else do I have time for? Until I see what's in my head manifest in this realm, this third dimensional realm. Because I have Cancer 12th house. My Mercury's in the 12th house. I believe it's my Mercury in the 12th house. I got 12th house energies, and I, I spend a lot of time, like, in another realm most of the time, in another realm. And I, I want to pull those things out to this realm. I want to create an environment. Either It could be for the carbonation rejects. It could be for people that weren't rejected but just didn't decide to go that direction. For us to be able to come together because a lot of us... Let's just be real. We may have naivety in different type of ways, and we may be followers. Everybody can't be the leader. Some people got to be the followers. We may be followers, but most of us, I've noticed, have a good heart. But they just be rolling with shit because they're comfortable, and, you know, they still got to work on their debilitations, too. They got to break themselves free, too. But for those that truly have a good heart, there's no reason that we can't come together and do this. But in the meantime, I'm going to do it by myself. I'm going to figure it out by myself. And it's all going to work out in my favor. I don't see it today. But I know. I know in my heart, in my stomach, in my gut that I am chosen. I'm the elite. And uh, I know this. This is a fact because I've been crying out to God ever since I was 18 years old, like a Muslim on the ground in a Christian church. I was Pentecostal. It's not a game. I feel like the extremity of, of Christianity is either Jehovah Witness or Pentecostal. I was Pentecostal. I rocked that shit. I rocked that shit. I, it was not every freaking man in the church wanted me. And I went to like, what, three different churches? Every man wanted me. And it's not about just beauty. It's about commitment like damn she for real she just young and she for real hell yeah i'm for real i got the heart of god man for real it's not a game i don't know if i need to walk this way or the other street i know she gets her over here um yeah so i am the pure in heart and i'm here to convict the weak and collect the elite Somebody actually said to me, the reason that you can't stay on that frequency is because you're the elite. The elite cannot stay on that frequency. What are you talking about? That's why you keep bouncing off all the time. That's neither here, or ne here nor there. We will find out in the future who the elite really is. That's not the truth. Yeah, we are going to find out who the elite are over time. Everything is going to be revealed because how do we find these things out? The way we cheat, treat each other, the way we interact with each other. And it's not always the person that's getting talked down on. That's the person that's bad. Because sometimes the elite will be talked down on. The elite will be, will be mistreated. It happens all the time. These are the tests. But I'm going to stand firm. I'm going to stand firm. And trust the universe. That if I don't listen to any of y'all advice, and I totally trust my intuition, and I don't follow carbonation moving forward, that my life is going to elevate. That don't mean I don't miss him. That don't mean I ain't going to miss him. That don't mean nothing. That just means I'm not allowing my emotions that he taught us as energy and motion to be all over the place. I'm, I'm focusing my energy so I can harness my, my talents and my gifts. Use my energy to harness things that are self, that serve me. 
And I might be boring to a lot of y'all. I might be dry to a lot of y'all. It's okay, man. I can get down to five people watching me and I'm good. Because those five people, if they're interacting with me all the time, that's going to make me feel like I'm doing something out here. Facts. If somebody comes out here, even one person comes out here, because of me, I feel like I'm doing my part. Facts. I'm going to stay in my lane. Peace to the gods on earth.